Exactly. It's just relentless. It's, it's not letting up. A soggy start to the weekend, soggy night. Tomorrow we'll get a little bit of sunshine, I think, squeezed in there, but then no. some more sogginess. Okay, I saw all the clouds <laughs> in your little forecast. Yeah, yeah, lots of clouds in the forecast and an extended, unsettled period looks like we're going to embark on. So get ready. Okay. Get those umbrellas out. We're going to need them. They're going to get a good <laughs> workout. But yeah, we're dealing with the soggy conditions right now as we get a live look. That's not Cape May. That's Center City, Philadelphia. But Cape May looks even worse than this scene because we're dealing with windy conditions right now. Winds really ramping up down the shore over the last couple of hours. Wind speeds now up around 20 miles per hour. We're up around 20 in Philadelphia. Wind speeds in the teens in the Lehigh Valley and seeing a gust in the last hour in Atlantic City. 48 miles per hour. Yeah, that makes for a miserable Saturday night. Combine that with the rain that is falling. Temperatures right now struggling as well. 72 degrees in Philadelphia. We only topped in the 70s today. As far as averages are concerned, we should be in the mid to upper 80s. Temperatures in the 60s in the Lehigh Valley. 50s in the Poconos. Hanging out in the 70s down the shore. We are dealing with this area of low pressure. The center of which is going to roll right through the Delaware Valley as we head into the next couple of hours. As you can see pushing all this moisture up and into our neck of the woods and we are starting to see now some heavier pockets of rain developing and starting to push closer into center city Philadelphia with some of the heaviest rain now positioned over South Jersey for portions of Salem County, Gloucester County, Camden County, also Burlington County seeing these heavier pockets as indicated by this yellow and orange color so stretching out over Williamstown up into Glassboro as well seeing a pretty good downpour overhead right now. Flash flood watch in effect we have had some areas is dropped off by the National Weather Service. That includes Delaware and portions of South Jersey and the shore, but still in effect for Atlantic County, Berks County, Philadelphia, and surrounding counties until 6 o'clock tomorrow morning. And we also could see maybe even an isolated severe thunderstorm. This will be concentrated closer to the coast. We do have this threat of a strong thunderstorm producing some gusty winds because of a low level jet that will be developing and sitting overhead throughout the overnight period. But overnight tonight, you know to what to expect. Rain heavy at times. Windy conditions with a couple of rumbles of thunder. 65 degrees are overnight low. And then for the day tomorrow, some sunshine, but then scattered storms developing as we head into the afternoon with a high temperature a bit warmer at 84 degrees. So future weather showing us as we head into the next several hours, still dealing with areas of rainfall, some quite heavy in intensity. This particular model, I think now a little bit overdone. I think the models in general overplayed the situation just a little bit. We still do have this flash flooding threat that we're still going to have to watch out for over the next several hours, but by about four o'clock in the morning, much of this rain will be lifting north and out of the area. Looks like we have a dry start to the day tomorrow with some breaks of sunshine, but then eye to the sky during the afternoon. We'll start to see these cells firing during the heat of the day, then primarily during the afternoon and early evening hours. We'll see that threat for some scattered storms, but then we'll maintain that chance of some thunderstorms spawning in nature as we head into tomorrow night, even into Monday morning. Monday afternoon and an unsettled pattern takes us into next week, but down the shore tomorrow. Watch out for some scattered storms, especially during the afternoon. Might see some sunshine in the morning, but watch out for taking a dip. High rip current risk along the coast tomorrow and at the Delaware beaches. Be sure to always swim in front of a lifeguard. Looks like Monday's another soggy day. Showers and thunderstorms possible both in the morning and in the afternoon. Humid and breezy hit her with storms on Tuesday. Hey, a couple more storms on Wednesday. Thursday looks like a pretty wet day with a front that comes through, but that will eventually dry us out just in time for next Friday. Oh, uh, so a mere, a mere week away. <laughs> yeah, okay. I mean, it's just right around the corner. Just around the corner. Yeah. Okay, we'll keep that umbrella yeah. handy. Thank, Thank you. I got the big one. <laughs> All right.